Hello, and again, welcome to Nobody's... Ow, oh, it's clicking. Nobody plays Minecraft here in Decidedly Vanilla. Um, I did some digging. I also changed this. Now it looks kind of cool, I think. I like it. The beacon now has stairs going up. So this is our level 5. And this is level 13. Again, the reason I picked 13 is because I can then go down to level 5, which you always be on top of bedrock and just point up and run. And it'll... That's level 13 right there. So we can actually do this and not worry about losing the floor and all that. So so if I want to like empty everything and see every possible block, we can because we can then see it there. And that's uh, cooking some iron. I actually have this set up now. So we'll throw iron and gold in the top chest. Uh, coal in this chest. It'll keep cooking. And when it's done cooking, it then sends it into the sorting system up top. So this takes care of this. And all the clickies. Okay, so what I really want to do is expand uh, the thing upstairs, the sorting system, and probably work on. We gotta, we gotta find the sponges we had. We really just gotta do that because I want to get the uh, monument cleared out a bit and get some stuff laid out here. And we just really need some, uh, yeah, we just need some supplies to do all that. So we'll put that in there. Uh, we're gonna go find our sponges. Um, some doors probably too. We'll take this just in case. And we want to get the ocean monument cleared out a bit so we can then go harvest a whole bunch of soul sand. Uh, let's put this away for now. Oh, we need more glass. Uh, we have glass cooking. We do. And stone. And stone. Okay. Because uh, we are going to put a lid on this slowly. We just got to get some more sand, which we have plenty, I think, back at base. The old base, which we gotta move to the new base. So here, boop, and there. So I'll make this so it's relatively safe. I picked light blue because I just did because it's way ahead of me. All right, let's head over to uh, old base, find some sponges, and see what we can get done. All right, we have two sponges. That's it. We just literally have two. I grabbed a bunch of nether racks. I think that might be quicker just to. Put in a bunch of netherrack and just bust it out real fast. In fact, if we start in a corner and just fill the interior with netherrack, um, and then maybe put the beacon and then just dig it out, that might be the fastest way. Doesn't sound very exciting, but I really think that might be the best way. Oh, this, I thought this was way closer. It is not. So, okay, Mushroom Island is, Island is very close to base. This is not, though. Are we transporting? Oh, I didn't hear the noise. That was weird. Okay. Um, we should have probably bought a furnace, which we did not. We can make one. All right. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There we go. And we have no room, so let's... Um, i gonna toss that out for now. Four. There's eight. All right. Let's make a furnace rack quick. We have no fuel, of course, so we'll go outside and get some kelp. And that'll take a little bit there. Um, do we have aqua affinity? We do. Oh, we should have, yeah, there, the conduits there, so we're good on that. Um, let's not die here. There we go. Not dying is good. All right, so we'll get this squared away and set up, and then we'll worry about, uh, yeah, figuring out the best way to do this in a bit once we get this all collected here. Okay, we got some kelp. We just got to, oh, we don't, uh, let's use some doors, I guess, to cook the first kelp. Not sure how many we need. We just really need to get, well, we need to get eight, so let's put the whole stack in. No, that's going to be too much. Um, oh, we can just use wood, charcoal. Let's do this as efficiently as possible. There, we got one. Let's pull that out. Use this to make some charcoal. And then charcoal to make the dried kelp to make stuff. So we're actually doing extra steps here, I know. But oh well. So we'll have one for that. There we go. We have a bunch of stuff on here. Sure I don't need. There we go. So that gives us that. So we'll use this to make charcoal. 
and charcoal to make more charcoal to make kelp to make dried kelp and then we'll cook it there okay so this is extra steps for absolutely no reason let's try yeah we'll need doors to separate these out just to make this easier and we want to keep that one that way however up here we do want to dig out okay so i think this yeah this room is a bad example we should really get to the top and work our way down to this room we're at 226 760 i'm not going to remember that there we go. Okay, so we're going to head out. Try to go right above that. Now it's just going to the top, top here. Excuse me. Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay. Here we go. They all start here, and they're all awful. <laughs> Let's put up a bunch of doors. Try to separate the water flow. Put on the sponge. See what happens. That didn't work. There it goes. That worked for that, and then we'll put one here. And that helped some too. Okay, now we have to go all the way back down, get our furnace with our stuff. You should have brought that. Yeah, it's two, 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 six, and seven. This isn't far, I don't think. So I'm just gonna dig straight down. See if we hit it. Nope. Excuse me. And we're all the way to the bottom. This is not the right place. Ah, it's over there. Yeah, it's right that way. Okay. Because that's where... No, let's just go this way. Nope, not here. Here? Not there. There we go. All right. Come on, let me in. Let me in. I'm getting shot. Oh, this is going to be bad. This is going to be bad. This is going to hurt a lot. Not good at all. Okay, this is bad. Um, where's the opening opening? Here? There it is. Do we have a bucket? We do. There we go. Woo, we made it. All right. Cool. All right. We have our stuff to do our sponges with now. Sweet. I'll just go there. Okay. All right. This is working, which is scaring the heck out of me. Um, I'm using my cheaty right click now. I was actually doing it block by block before. I'm just going to see how this works. Uh, we're going to get ourselves in a corner here, which is fine. No, I don't, don't, don't want to place those. I'm going to place these. That way we are consistently... There we go. We have better night vision um, when we're in the water because we have the uh, conduit set up. Here we go. So if we can see, it means we have a leak somewhere. There we go. And since it's on Instamine, essentially with the efficiency 5 with the uh, netherrack, we can just uh, kind of tap this stuff out. Just hit a few buttons and boom. So this did take a while to fill. It's that versus uh, doing all the uh, sponges and separating the rooms. I kind of think I like this better. You just literally, I mean, you can turn your brain off for this. It's just uh, throw in a bunch of uh, netherrack, which we have plenty of, obviously. Uh, where's that source at? There it goes. Okay. kind of place the blocks and uh, it's easy enough to dig out because it, it doesn't uh... oops did I want to break that one there we go yeah it might be better to place them slower because we're, we're getting a lot of uh, missed ones here doing it this way there we go different approach I've never tried this before I've never seen this done the reason I may not see it, it may not be a very efficient way. That's why we're testing it for science. Uh, where's that? There's the source there. Yeah. Okay. Good. A couple sources up here. That's why I just keep a little bit of another egg offhand. Right click to break it real quick, and then left click to knock it down. Break the sources with the right click, and break the block with the left click. There we go. Yeah, this one's gonna have yeah. This will, this is the section I thought would have some surprises. This is the one I did the. Uh, Cheaty, quickly place everything at once, right click. And 
now once we head out this way, just trying to pick up all the blocks we can just to help a bit with lag and entities. This should all be 100% filled in. Oop, let me go back. So we'll start at the top, work our way down. Missed one, apparently. I missed a whole section up here, okay. That's it easy enough. Okay, I'm liking this way. I did put a few doors up to block off areas where we uh, haven't gotten to yet, but here we essentially just uh, we want to light it up better later just so we can see everything, but just for clearing it out, it's just uh, place down a bunch of netherrack. Go to town. This whole section here. Filled with water. I think we got two drop down sections there. We should have brought more wood so we can make ladders. Yeah, here's where I blocked off because that's yeah, a whole other area over there. So we just have that blocked for now because I wasn't sure how much another rack or how much durability is left on this pick. So yeah, we're getting low. We might have to go repair this. Um, and the portal, I think it's down this one or the other one. I'm not sure. Do we have. Okay, we got wood so we can make. Uh, oops. So we can make us. Uh, uh, Oh, yeah. Okay, so yeah, the portal's right there. We actually have to go that way because this has no water to go back up. But from here, that's safe now. Good. Okay. Cool. A new way to do stuff. Let me know what you think in the comments. Oh, and today is also the day before game day when I'm recording this Friday. I'm actually going to have to cut this short set to get it edited before uh, work and get it uploaded. Um... Uh, official game day is next weekend. This uh, would be uh, the 26th. So the 27th is going to be the our uh, Quack Attack unofficial game day where a lot of people, uh, Rufio, J, um, trying to think who else uh, from Quack Attack is for sure streaming. A lot of the people are streaming too. I think Link is starting this evening. Uh, even though he's not Quack Attack, he's still extra life and awesome. So. Uh, be sure to check out that. I'll try to have everybody oops, hosted on Twitch if I can remember. Yeah, we did not get this section yet, so let's just block that off. Uh, so do join us. Uh, game day is awesome. It's a 25-hour stream of it because uh, the official game day is going to be... Uh... Did that do it? That did it. Okay, good. Uh is uh, with uh, daylight savings and all that fun stuff. So, yes, yeah, 25 hours of non-stop gaming. A lot of awesome people doing it again. Stop by. It's all raising money for Extra Life. If you want to join in, uh, and I'm not doing game day. Uh, I'm too old. <laughs> I don't uh, I don't want to sit for 24 hours. I can't do it. Um, if you can or want to break it up, you don't have to do 24 hours. Obviously, you can still join. There we go. have to do the 25 to be part of extra life it is encouraged but you know definitely not a requirement um where are those other bricks then i thought they would go right up here are they on this side nope where the heck are they let's pillar up that way okay let's see where those are oh that's just above us oh so they might have been here just up yeah so definitely check that out sorry my brain no work Okay, that was it. That's all we had to do. Okay, beautiful. So we got a large section of this done, which is awesome. Not even a large section. We got a part of a section done, which is awesome. Um, we're going to keep the conduits there. Might just bust a hole in this side here and just come in this way. Hi, guys. Yeah, well, let's do this over here. We'll keep the conduit. Uh, there we are. Here. Then is there a back door? Yep, we'll just put this up here. Nope, put doors here so we know what's at. There we go. So we're going to call it there. Alright, so yeah, my brain, I'm just thinking of stuff to do, but we'll get this side to get edited and all the fun stuff. Okay, so thank you for watching. Be sure to again, check out our game day. Oh, this guy, we should kill him and clear out this room. Oh, there's a roof. Never mind. Yeah, we're going to have to work our way down. We'll do that better next time. Alright, so thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. See you on game day. And the official game day is the week next weekend. I forget the date. The 6th or 8th or whatever the heck the next Saturday is. Uh, trying to pull up my calendar here. The 2nd. Not even close. No, the 3rd. It's the 3rd. So check it out then. 
We'll see a lot of big streamers already doing it then. That's official game day. It's a lot of things. Check out the official Extra Life channel for that. Um, there's going to be a lot of cool stuff going on. Some of our uh, Quack Attack members are actually going to be uh, on the Extra Life channel, I think. Um, oh, no, maybe not. I think we're trying to convince that guy, so we'll keep that in the down low. Uh, so thanks for watching. We'll talk to you later. Bye, guys. Thank you.